People, welcome back to Yard and Abroad TV. Please remember to hit the subscribe button, turn on post notification, like, comment, share, and subscribe. As I said, if you're not familiar with this channel, we talk about issues in Jamaica, the Caribbean, and the whole world, people. Wagwan people, Wagwan, welcome back to my channel. So yo people, you don't know so once again there we're gonna talk about this plane where so-called quote unquote crash land a rocky point people. So now a businessman has threatened to sue police after search of his rocky point home people. So police decide say they're gonna go search this man's house and I guess they was going door to door a search other homes as well people this is 72 hours after the plane crash land and pilot and passenger gone people which i think that is too late to start the door to door them man they probably reach a them destination which part them will go or back in them country me no know so what i'm going to do people is i'm going to read your article from the jamaica observer then i'm going to play the clip at the end of this video to make you hear what the residents in Rocky Point is saying about the businessman and why police are targeting. You see me people? So make sure you watch the full video to hear what the people them in Rocky Point are saying about the businessman who is constantly being targeted by the police people. And as I say, I'm getting this article from the Jamaica Observer. So it goes on to say, owner of White Sand Beach seafood restaurant in rocky point nicholas graham is threatening legal action against the state after his home was searched and items allegedly damaged by police in his absence the businessman said he has since met with his legal team and has sought advice on what steps he should take to be compensated for his distress as well as damage to his property graham who is also a resident of the rocky point community claimed that a senior officer from the maypen police station led a team to his house where they rummaged through his personal belongings sometime after 11 a.m sunday morning while he was on the scene where a plane crash the night before so i guess they was doing the door to door from sunday but here we have this gentleman not home he's at the crash site of the plane and yet police guy in house and i search it up which i think that is illegal he goes on to say while i was on the crash site me get a call so police and soldiers were on my premises at no point did anyone contact me or approach me with a search warrant. He said adding that he was fearful and paranoid about the prospect of returning home. Right now, I don't know if them plant anything or leave anything in my house when they were there so they can come back and arrest me for it later he said noting that his home is well secured by a perimeter fencing which should not have been breached without his permission the businessman said there has been significant damage to his home and furniture and over 300 thousand in local currency and us 207 dollar is missing me I take action this time against them because all the time them harass me, said the businessman, who wondered why he was not able to be at peace at his home. Graham said he was unclear why he was targeted by police as the crash site was approximately two miles away from his place of business. Them I try to tarnish my business and I try to make it look like illegal activities taking place at my place of business. I am a simple restaurant owner who sells seafood. Me don't know nothing at all about the plane we crash, and I was just there looking like everybody else who was excited about what happened. So me don't know the reason why police come here, come dig up my place. He added that the officer has his contact details and could have called when he realized there was no one home. Instead, him let man in my house and make them thief the money and ramsack my place and gone. Graham has since visited the Maypen police station in the presence of his lawyer and was taken into custody for questioning. So, men and know people, I don't know what to take of the story. But just know say you did have, you should 
have a search warrant if you're going into somebody's place to search it up and especially if nobody wasn't home i don't think it's right that you know you kick off man fence or do or whatever and go in there and do what you want that i don't think is right but then again why the police target his house for go search and go ramsack and for thief the man money at that i know me i tell him i know i mean i know people that to me when you work your hard honest working money people and face somebody come in your house and thief it and take it it kind of rough and as we say we are on the outside looking in we don't know what we're going we don't know what going on the businessman why police are take set panning we don't know we just they are read article and assume and I make assumptions on what could have happened or what took place you see me people so right now people i'm going to play you the video of the people and the residents in rocky point and what am i talking about you see me people much love check it out and let me know when i think all right suspicion of harbor and fugitive how can you cover somebody please come come say you have a suspicion of fugitive you don't come see him in my place you don't come see no fugitive you don't come see nobody so you will you look at him doing going now so you will have him you don't have only man with you to think you're saying that. Hey, man, you're saying Jimmy Akaya. It's about sink with the wall of wind. Unfortunately, I've planned an emergency landing around the sea area, the White Sand Beach, not the restaurant, the beach. However, civilian citizen reached before the Jamaica Constable Force. Upon our. Go on, go on, go on. Upon arrival, they don't draw any yellow tape, no forensic citizen do their own thing, a drive plane as you can see from the media, and they do their own investigation. Rocky Point is a one way in community. If they want to find fugitive the night that they arrive on the scene, where they didn't block the road and search from home to home, they come and want somebody yard. See, yeah, they were the fix it fan. One person yard. And they call it what I don't know. They left Sunday, they search yard without a theme, without immediately in the house. And they search the house and they take up in much, much thousand. And they were like planning for Sunday and all. I know they can't let him then come back to do our next search again. For what? Ask Andrew Wallace or the plane reach at Jamaica. The man cannot know that Andrew Wallace be no way. Or oh, oh, they are ready and pick up the plane where I land at Jamaica. Oh! Mike Henry said the plane supposed to land in Vernon Field. Why do I take it for Rocky people? If you go down and get a bit, go find out who out there and go do investigation. You want to. One, one, one person in a Rocky Pine. One person. I don't know one person in Rocky are more than 1,000 people there are Rocky Pine. And all I know. All I know, I want somebody here then day. So that means a fugitive Ghana yard long time. Good about reach a Mexico and good as a book flight Ghana yard long time. Them, them come and search. The coffee lock, go inside, search. Nobody take where they want and, and take where they don't want and come out. <laughs> and when they come out and when they come back, now they come back to the again. From about 11 o'clock, like 10 o'clock after 3. Where they searching looking for? Ganja, coke, gun, dead man, living man. Where they looking for? A woman? Money, where are you looking for? This how was that day? For the day, five years ago now, yeah. up in White Sand Beach. For the day up in White Sand Beach until today day. Police not have come terrorize him. In my most this, in my most that. They have got him pint that they all give him sitting for carry when they give him for carry. Them see him one call another police to hold him on the highway with it. Give him sitting for their auntie. I went time in Teki. I went time they hold him. I jobs they have in a hit. They have got a court feed. See him with in the open place, in here, in no peace. A man paranoid, in paranoid, in paranoid. No peace. No peace. Plane coming out of the district. And it has circle right round and round the district. So tell you, go make crash land. In I see. They must say, in taking fugitive. How could a man, when no say every 24 hour police are coming in place, I go care fugitive go put in place. Tell me. Come on, no, that too. Eh? Come, baby, I need They must say, no, 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 the panic play. About 40 had the 15 gallon uh, uh, petrol in it. And I citizen them take it off. They have a whole boat over this street. They have a whole boat. But the police then are come to no investigating. Then just comes up, brought a uh, one man yard. See a peer shake where I go on. Plane come and the whole of his seat are grown and run go up. They go look at everything. And three man go look at this happen. I ain't put up man. How you have to put up pilot? The pilot then gone about their business and that is a yard then take. Take set pan. You can't have pilot in our house, but instead the police then concert. I don't find nothing and still a kumba. If they mean a come round and go ask people that went tell them that I know all in here, my boy, they were care when man they go put them like vaccine but I care them with.
Then I want here, then I ask no. Then just come here, so. See, now I'm 7 30, I'm by 11 o'clock, yard full. He had full of police. A soldier come, 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 take it, come, come for him. He not did it. He man not did it. And then broke down the man back door and go in and place and search up and take away money where they want to take up. Nobody at all know that he had. Me don't know who they read search warrant to or if they have none. Nobody. So he left and go out of the station and go out of the station. If he go out of the station, they will and find him till now. And they have him in the house. From 11 o'clock in the house, I know after 3. I'll know. I'll know. After 11 this morning, then they know after 4 p.m. What are they looking for? And they already do a thoroughly search from Sunday. One thoroughly search from Sunday, man, over here and hungry and want dead like they want to starve. Nothing. We want justice. Okay, you can't take it one for people. Child, and your wholeness. Edmund Bartlett and R.S. Strong, we need to make it people that do their job and talk make sense to do their job because we cannot do it because we don't know. We can't talk or we don't know. If they want information, they need to go send out the team and make them go walk house to house. I want house there and they put for news so they walk house to house. I want house. See you want house there. We need justice and every time they do it, they fly, fly, rocky, they say it, make it fly, fly. If rain fall, they say it, they freeze, blow, they say it. I got that. I want man, I want that. We want justice. They let him up for one hour and say they have to do interview for one hour. And I don't know if someone has to do interview, he can't present himself. Jimmy, you can have resources to do interview, but they want to take it for somebody. No, for instance, they got the plane, they got the plane crash. I want to drop it up out of the sky, I want it to come from nobody, but they're playing up the rocky people are flying. We don't need to do better, we need justice. Ask Andrew Wallace say, where I play Richard Jamaica. He might ask him, where am I going to go?